checking out this PBN service and I just want to give you my my thoughts on it you know what to avoid when purchasing PBN links so um, we're here on, on uh, Blackout World looking at Dragon Lubes PBN service um, scroll down some metrics very impressive off the start DA50 plus um, DR30 plus uh, you know incredible metrics now if you scroll down scroll down there's some pricing somewhere it's like 20 something dollars I think it's 21 after discount per post excuse me so very uh, you know a higher end PBN but it, it's justified right the metrics DR30 plus DA50 plus RD600 plus you know these are metrics wise amazing sites um, and so I asked for some samples like you should when you're purchasing, uh, you know, niche edits, guest posts, PBNs, it's always worth looking at some samples um, because it can kind of tell you, uh, can paint you a big picture. So here are three samples. Um, you know, first of all, a lot of high quality PBNs, a lot of guys won't even give you samples. Um, so I kind of have mixed feelings with, it's hard to judge without having samples, but if they're giving you samples then they're not even a PBN, they're like a, a very, very public blog network. Um, and so here we are, you know, off the bat, pretty much zero keywords, zero traffic, you know, which is normal for a PBN, but it's not normal for a PBN that's charging, you know, over $10 a post, over even $20 a post. Um, you know, as you start to climb up $20 a post, 30, 40, 50, even $100 a post, some PBNs charge, they're more like guest posts, the quality you're getting. Um, but you're, you're expecting traffic, right? Like, there's no difference between, you know, a zero, there's very little to gain between, you know, this site and a site with zero traffic and, and 10 DR. You know, it's just, it has more. So this tells part of the picture, but I already know what I'm going to see because I, I, first of all, I've looked, but even before then, I knew what I was going to see when you, when you pull up the big picture here, or we'll pull up any of these. Um, and you can see, you, you see a graph like this, it's spammed. If there's any sort of jump in referring domains, it's spammed. And so it's really unfortunate that someone like this is selling on Black Eye World. It's mislabeled, like, it's very mislabeled, it's misinformed, like, it's, it's, I don't want to say it's, a, it is, dis, it probably is a scam. It's deceitful, I guess. So, um, you you know, someone who wouldn't ask for samples and just goes off of metrics, you know, I guess there's a saying of a man and his money are soon parted or something like that. Um, where you know if if you come along and you don't know what you're buying you're gonna lose your money so um kind of just wanted to give you my thoughts this service you know i know this guy has some other better services but you know when you're looking at these pbns in this price range they can be worth it um you know hardcore biker is one of the a, a decent provider on here hatred there's probably many more i, I try to test as many as i can but there's so many always coming out and it just takes a lot of work to sort through the, the garbage um, and even then, a moderator said, um, the PBN, like three of the domains have the same IP address. Like, what is that? You know, and, and the register is the same for all domains. That's insane. That is so, it's, it's all the, it's not even like it shares, you know, all the domains share three registrars or something simple. They literally all use the same registrar for all the domains, which, you know, like I said, you might expect that kind of garbage if you're paying a dollar a PBN but you're paying 24 25 whatever it is $21 for a link you expect uh, you know something a little better um, and so I don't really there's no real use for something like this the problem is like if they were a lot cheaper you could send these as tier 2 and they'd be fine but at $21 you know even with my clients who have deep pockets like it doesn't make sense. Like, it doesn't make sense how much money you have. It's just, it's a bad buy. You could get the same amount of value from just buying dollar or three dollar PBN links. Um, it's deceitful. Let's pull this up. This is this is the this is the real part that kind of annoys me. Is that they're all spammed, right? Here we go. Sixteen. I don't know if I got a little bit of spam right there. It looks like it jumped. Oh man too many tabs open my computer's kind of getting slow but jumps once jumps twice um and that's how the dr goes up right you, you just spam with some gsa 
and that's what happens. I mean, we can go look specifically at what's actually going on, but again, from nothing to spam to spam. Oh, we got an awesome PPN now with a thousand plus referring domains. Such garbage. I can't believe this stuff is, uh, you know, allowed to exist on the forum, and I'm sure, you know, not before long, moderators will get tr crack down on this and uh, and close it. But let's take a look. Yellow pages. Looks like just a bunch of there's a bunch of redirects there. Just like it's just all GSA. I can't really tell the exact link type, but it's all GSA. Garbage. Pretty much garbage. Um, and so don't don't waste your money. You know, when you guys are looking for PBNs over $10, check them a little closer. You need a little bit of traffic to justify it. Otherwise, you know, just go for something cheaper. So anyways, guys, I'll talk to you later.